This is a Black Friday 2024 Filmora buying guide. Welcome to this video. My name is David and I hope you're well wherever you are around the world. Now, which Filmora version should you buy? This really depends on your use case. For example, I'd prefer the yearly plan because I'll keep using uh, the AI features with the AI credits that come with it. Somebody else may prefer the perpetual license such that you own Filmora once and for all and you'll never need to pay for it again unless you change maybe your operating system or move to a new laptop or maybe you lose your license or whatever. You know what's best for you but let me tell you what's best right now because it's up to 30% off this Black Friday and you can see or use the link in the description below to sign up for Filmora if you don't have Filmora. So if I scroll down slightly you'll get the first option is the Filmora Perpetual. The reason why this would be a recommendation is if you're only going to be using one system. Let's say if you're on Windows and you don't want to ever pay a single dime extra to use this. I'd go with this one, get the discount or whatever you want with it. Now, if you want to use macOS, there's also an option for macOS. But this is highly limited because you only have to either choose Windows or macOS. The other plans that are available are multi-platform plans. And this is a sweet spot because for one license, you can use it on Windows, Mac OS, iOS, iPad OS, and Android. So you buy Filmora once for these yearly plans and you can use it across the board. That is on your mobile phone on Android, your mobile phone on iOS, you can use this. So as for Filmora multi-platform, there are three more or less uh, packages. We've got this one, uh, more AI features included, 20% off. Just to be clear, the AI features are similar across the board. There's no major difference here. The only major difference here is just some little teeny tiny tweaks. So for example, if you look at this one, the 47.99 per year, uh, that's on offer and also depends maybe on where you are around the world, these offers do vary. So this is Filmora's ultimate version with advanced features and AI tools providing creative freedom across all devices. Now. These two are the same. The only differences could be something like the storage. You can see this is 10 GB, this is 1 GB, and also maybe something like the number of AI credits you get per month. Uh, me, I personally have this one, uh, which is uh, really awesome for me, uh, but everything else is identical. There's no major difference, so really depends on your budget. Now, this center one is the one that's up to 30% off, but I believe what they're working on, it has almost it has a, okay it has everything that's available right inside here it's just that it's more or less marketing here but more or less this is billed yearly so if you ask me which version should you get depending on your usage i'd go with this one this is more or less what works especially if you use the ai features in filmora they tend to eat on the ai credits and if you're not a heavy user uh, of Filmora, then this is actually going to work really, really well for you. So it depends on what you want. You can either go for Filmora Perpetual, only available on one platform that is either Windows or Mac OS, or you can go with Filmora Multi-Platform. And this is the sweet spot uh, in my use case scenario, Windows, Mac OS, iOS, iPad OS, and Android. So that's Black Friday 2024 Filmora Buying Guide. Which one should you choose? And I think uh, the choice is clear, uh, but it also depends on you. Now, you've got up to eight days to purchase. Uh, otherwise, the prices will go back uh, to uh, the uh, normal price. Although Filmora runs offers year in year. So you can grab it right now for the offers up to 30% off that's available. I hope this video is of value to you. Thanks for watching.